Hey everybody, Prepper Nurse Juan here. It is still August 17th. It is Monday, 2020. So I'm going to show you what I did, but we're going to talk also about a topic. And, uh, you know, I, I, I get so many comments, and some of them I just have to laugh at, and some of them I'm just like, okay. So we're going to talk about, first thing we're going to talk about is priorities. All right? So I had somebody make the comment, and they were like, well, you know, your sister's place is looking much better than your place is on the inside, okay? Uh, you know, just saying. Okay, well, that, that's that's all well and good, um, you know, and... Uh, so let's, let's talk about that a second, okay? Let's talk about priorities. My priorities um, is not having the brand new uh, hardwood floor in my place. Now, do I want that eventually? Sure. Yeah, I want it eventually. But I had other priorities that needed to be addressed this year, okay? Other priorities. Not if I have a nice hardwood floor, um, if I have tongue and groove pine, um, on the walls, which I eventually want to do that as well. That's not a priority right now. What a priority was this year was putting in a new battery room, was picking up new batteries to have um, for my solar system to make my life better because power is an important part of, you know, making your life comfortable, right? So that was a priority this year. Let me show you another priority this year. Another priority this year was getting that woodshed done, right? And then picking up 18 more face cord of wood this year. That was a priority, all right? Because now I don't have to have my stuff up on pallets. I don't have to have um, my wood under tarps. That was a priority this year, okay? Um, so building that building, building my battery room, Buying new batteries, buying all that wood, okay? Oh, let's talk about another priority that we decided to do this year. Raised bed gardens, right? Again. Now, did I need to have it? No, I didn't need to have it, but it was a priority for um, longevity of what I want to do and what I want to accomplish here at the homestead. So, yeah, so we put in... The raised beds this year we bought a ton of gravel this year all right um, we've done a lot of transformations here at the homestead this year uh, my sister getting her place in here all right you know and they're working on it and uh, they have things to do and, and stuff like that in there and that's fine uh, you know I'm okay and I'm comfortable living the way that I'm living right now now, down the road, when I have things all in place the way I would like them to be here, will I focus on the inside of my home? Yeah, I'll focus on the inside of my home. But I had other priorities that were more important than if I have hardwood floors in my house or if I have tongue and groove pine you know, walls and ceiling in my house, which I will have eventually. And guess what? When I do do that, it's going to look awesome. Okay, But again... Other things were much more important this year. Oh, well, let's let's talk about another priority. Seven truckloads, seven truckloads of manure brought in this year as well. All right, having that brought here because I wanted to make sure that these gardens are what you're seeing now. That they're doing that. Okay, so those were priorities. Um, you know, I'm comfortable in my house. I'm okay with the way my house is. Um, it's not, you know, is it the Taj Mahal? Nope. But guess what? Let me let me explain something too, okay? See that building right there? And everything in that building is paid for, okay? That building there and everything in that building is paid for. That building there and everything in that building is paid for. All these raised beds that you see here, they're all paid for. I have no mortgage. I'm not in debt up to my eyeballs, okay? I don't care what people think as far as um, how my house looks on the inside. That is not, I'm not trying to keep up with anybody. That's not my priority. Maybe it's your priority. Maybe you have to have the best of this or the best of that. That's fine. If that's the way you feel that you need to do it, knock yourself out. Max out those credit cards, okay? I don't have credit cards. I don't do anything unless I can afford to do it, 
all right and so I'm you know and I'm not trying to be an a-hole about this I'm just saying everybody has different priorities my priorities were to get things squared away here so that these things here guys these raised beds and again once I get the rest of the capstones on everything um, they're gonna be here forever uh, as long as I'm alive anyway they're gonna be here they're gonna be usable they're gonna be functional and I think that's important okay now eventually obviously you know and, and the thing is too let, let's let's remember something else I'm also a bachelor okay I don't, you know, I don't have a woman that's like, oh my God, we got to do this, or oh my God, we got to do that, so, you know, that she's happy, okay? I do whatever I want to do. So, again, you know, it's like, when I saw that, I'm just like, okay, yeah. And, and oh, and just, you know, just so we're being 100% honest with stuff, I help them with this building, okay? And I'm not going to tell you how much. But I helped them because they needed that help, okay? And that's my family. And I'm going to do what I have to do to help my family. So, again, other priorities. Oh, it looks like we're going to get some rain here. It was really nice and clear and everything. Okay, so now that I've done talking about that. But, again, you know, people need to think about that. What are your priorities? What's more important? What needs to be done? What has to be done? Am I trying to, you know, impress you with my home? It's, you know, it's functional, it works, it works for me. So, you know, I have other things that are priorities. So, I wanted to show you, uh, I did five wheelbarrows of stone, alright? So, if you guys remember from the earlier video, none of this was here. So, I put stone all through here. And I got stone all on this side as well now. So, all these beds, um, other than in the front of these ones here, of these three beds... Uh, I need to put some stone in front of those three beds. But other than that, these beds are all squared away as far as stones. Now, I did not put any kind of vapor barrier down. I didn't do anything like that because what I can do as things grow up like this here. You see this thing here? I just do this. Boom. There you go. And that's that. Um, something grows through it, I'll just pull it out. Not a big deal. But it makes it a much cleaner look. I like the way it looks. It came out very, very well. Okay. So um, I did that earlier, got that squared away, and uh, we didn't end up, we're going to end up doing the greenhouse, um, putting the tape on it tomorrow, because um, like I said, it looks like actually we're going to get some rain here. Uh, so, okay, much more open. I moved the other 300 pounds of uh, uh, feed for the birds uh, out into the chicken coop so that part is now done as well let me go in here and we'll take a look at this uh, you know again this year guys I bought these five batteries I just bought three more that are coming I bought these two charge controllers this year uh, they're not giving this stuff away none of this stuff is cheap <laughs> you know and I'm not like, oh, look at me, I'm so important. That's not what I'm talking about. That's not why I'm saying that. Uh, I've spent a lot of money this year making our lives better, you know. Um, now I don't have to just run my home. I'm going to need to also run my sister's home because they're going to be off-grid as well. So, you know, that's why I ended up buying three more batteries as well, you know, because, it's again, you know, when you're working together and you're trying to make life better, you do what you have to do, okay? And it's family, and, you know, I want my mom and my sister here, and uh, that way I can keep them safe and protect them. Uh, the batteries are doing well. No issues with the batteries. i got to bring this box in. I put everything in the box um, from earlier. And so what did I, okay, so where I earlier was talking about uh, what I'm going to eat today, you know, that I was going to eat only from what I have here. So I had like three eggs earlier. I scrambled up three eggs. And then uh, I had, I ended up having uh, two tomatoes and a cucumber. And then, again, like I said, I had some green beans and some uh, of the peas as well. So, you know, just, uh, and I'm good right now. So, and I think it's about, I think we're after four in the afternoon. But, uh, so this here area, if you remember, that was all much higher, all built up there. Um, I pulled this back here, back from that tree, 
And actually, if I want to, I could pull more of the stone off of the fence here. I could do that as well. Uh, but I cleaned this up so it wasn't all... I literally, from this, just from this area right here, I took out five wheelbarrows full of stone um, and utilized it in the garden. Uh, I could still pull more out of here if I wanted to. Uh, I'm pro like I said, I still have this here. I can utilize that if I want to. I like actually some of that. I'm just going to take the shovel and I'm going to put it over here where, or uh, either that or just rake this stuff over because you can see some of that's high or that's low. But I could still hit this part here too. So it really depends on what I feel like doing. Um, I may leave this the way it is, but I definitely got to pull some of that stone back into that dry spot. But, uh, yeah, all of a sudden it got dark. It was really, it was sunny all day long, guys. Just gorgeous, beautiful day. But, uh, you know. So anyway, um, I just, I, I, when I saw that, it was like, and you know, and I get it. I, you know, as far as uh, earlier what I was talking about, like with, you know, the priorities, you know. Trolls are going to do what they're going to do. They're going to try to get under your skin. Um, they're going to try to agitate you. Like I had, um, oh, I know. The, the, so, okay, so here's here's the other thing. And it was like two different ones. And, and, and I know a trollish comment when I see a trollish comment. I mean, even if they don't come in there and call you a straight-out a-hole, um, they were like, you know, uh, five takes yesterday in the live stream. The new record, too, by the way, uh, the second take was one second. I basically went live, and it was a black screen, and so I had to end it, because there was nothing. There was no picture, so I had to end it and start again. Now, people were like, well, you, you would think that you'd want to get that squared away. And then I had somebody saying, well, it's on your end. No, it's not on my end. Um, I had a guy that worked for Time Warner uh, before they became Spectrum, and uh, he did a, helped me walk through a diagnostic of my Internet, because I thought maybe I needed a higher speed Internet. And he said, no, man, your stuff is good. And I've talked about this before, so I'm going to talk about this again as well, okay? When you have trolls and they can bombard your IP address, okay, they can, they can kick you offline, and that's what they do, all right? It has nothing to do with me. It could it be YouTube as well, not liking a topic that I'm talking about, interfering. Um, like one of, the, one of the things that happened last night, I'm talking away. And all of a sudden, everybody's like, we can't hear you. There was no volume. Is that on my end? No, that's not on my end. So, again, they want to try to goad me. They want to try to get me going. Um, so, like, I, I encouraged the one guy, um, if he felt that I was trying to see what he was insinuating. Let's talk about what he was insinuating. He was insinuating that I was, I'm the one doing it. Because I'm trying to get as many streams as I can so that I get more revenue. So, it's like, if I have to stop and start five times... Um, I can put more ads, you know, on, on the videos and, and make more money. I'm going to tell you what. When I do a stream, like yesterday, and we were into the first stream, and we were up to 1,200 people in the first stream. We were having a great conversation. I think we were 20-something minutes in, and they kick you off, okay? What ends up happening is not everybody can find you again to get back on for the next chat, and they have issues doing that, okay? So why would I do that? And the thing is, that's very shady to do something like that anyway, and that ain't my style. Anybody that's watched my channel for any length of time knows how I am. I'm honest as the day is long. I'm always straightforward. I never lie or BS. Oh, i got to show you guys something. Oh, I can have another treat. Look at this. I got blueberries. I did not even see those that were ready. Mmm. Oh, my God, guys. <laughs> Very, very good. Again, if it's from here, I can eat it. Oh, those were good. <laughs> those were really good. So, anyway. Sorry, distraction. Oh, it's shiny. Look at that. Um, look at my peaches, too. Hold on. We'll go over here. They're ripening up. Look at that. One, two, three, four, five. On that tree, uh, has this one got any... No, this one doesn't have any. But five peaches on that tree this year. So, very cool. So anyway, like I said, people are going to, they're going to play games. And, uh, you know, I'm, I'm not in the mood to play games. I don't play games. I say it like it is. I'm always honest. Um, I'm not going to BS you guys. So, you know, like I said, I just do what I got to do. 
And if people like it, cool. If they don't, I encourage you to go watch something else. I really do. Because it's like, you know, if you think I'm trying to screw around, uh, play games, oh, bugs. Um, then, like I said, you're more than welcome to go on down the road and watch somebody else. But uh, anyway, I'm going to get this box in the house before this rain actually does hit. So it's been a good day, uh, productive. Moving the stone, uh, moving the, the feed and stuff like that, that's just nothing but bulwark. And so it sucks, <laughs> but it's a good workout. So anyway, I'm going to jump off here, guys. I hope everybody's doing well. Um, before you judge somebody, see why they do what they do. And I, like I said, I get it. The person, they ain't got a clue. They don't have a clue. But I got my priorities straight, trust me. Um, I've always had my priorities straight. So that's, uh, you know, and if maybe, maybe they're jealous of that, I don't know. But uh, anyway, guys, I hope everybody's doing fantastic. I definitely want to hear your feedback. Please like, comment, and share. Um, and if you are not subscribed, please make sure you subscribe. Make sure you hit that bell icon as well to get all notifications. Um, and again, make sure you hit that thumbs up, okay? So anyway, we are all in this together. That is important to remember. A lot of people don't realize that, but it is very true. Also remember, guys, hug and kiss the ones you love. Tell them every single day. Tomorrow's not guaranteed. We never know what's going to happen in life, so it's really important that we tell the people that we care about every single day how we feel. Also remember, guys, STD. It's one step at a time, one thing at a time, and one day at a time. Whatever you're trying to do, whatever you're trying to accomplish, you can do it. The only person that's going to stop you from reaching those goals is you. That's it. Nobody else is going to stop you from doing that, okay? I hope everybody's having a great day. I will talk to you all later. Prepper Nurse One, out for now. And the puppies are being lunatics like always. Because that's what they do.